Ginger Beauty. So welcome back to my channel. It's another exciting episode of Cherie Tries to Do a Washing Up. <laughs> um, you guys know already how I feel about washing goes. I did, however, get several new products during the Black Friday sales and everything. So I will be testing them out today. I am going to be using, as you can tell by the title of this video, the Myel Organics Coil Sculpting Custom. This is a coil sculpting custom. It's supposed to be lightweight, easy to finger comb, long lasting, deep definition, and brilliant shine. So I'm looking forward to all of that. The product consistency is very light. Um, I think I may have already shown you guys this, but you can see it's very thick though. It's jiggly. So it's deep definition. Can we see what this is? There we go. So I've already primed my hair with their wonderful leave-in conditioner. I'm also testing out a theory about a styling tool, which is the three-row comb. Now I used to have one of these and um, this is back in the day when I used to style natural hair. Um, for clients as well as myself and um, I don't know what I used to use it for I'm not even sure why I bought it but I had a three row comb, comb for a while we are going to check this out today see if it makes a difference when applying these tools that you would traditionally when applying these products that you would traditionally use for um, washing those and things like that so let's see so just kind of get my hair under the cap like I normally do just to keep everything hydrated. Um, you know, once you start doing the wash and go and you get outside of the shower, you kind of have to work with the moisture that you have unless you want to keep spraying it with the spray bottle. And I find that the cap just keeps that moisture locked in so much better than me grabbing this spray bottle every five seconds. So, oh wow, so when you try to pick this up, <laughs> it's like super gooey. Definitely custard. Like. Right, so let's see how this goes. Mm, yeah. Definitely a ton of slip. I'm just going to run this comb through. Oh, can I get the comb through? Hold up. Oh. Well, yeah, I definitely think it does make a difference. That's pretty nice right there. All right, I'm gonna keep going. For me, I think the main point of this is to avoid all this shingling and strand by strand business. I don't have time to do all of that. But if I can use this three row comb and get you know, some of that extra definition in my hair, I'll do that.
wow. <laughs> this is really, yeah, this is mind blowing. I don't know if the comb is like making it like extra defined or if it's the product. I should do one side with it and one side without, but I really want it to all like turn out uniform. So I don't know. You guys let me know if you want me to in the future do a video where I use the comb for one side and one side without the three row comb. Um, this is also a new product in my ear, so I don't know <laughs> where the results are coming from, but right now this looks pretty amazing as far as definition definition go okay i probably should stop touching it This feels really good going on. It sounds, it kind of makes that soapy sound, like, you know, when you're like washing your hair. I'm literally seeing like no frizz at all. Like no frizz. Like, this is mind blowing right now. All right, I'm gonna continue on with the rest of my hair. Continue on with the rest of my hair, come back when I'm fully done before I go under the dryer. Okay guys, I'm back. Um, the coil sculpting custard is fully applied to all my hair. I'm not seeing it for now. So that three row comb, I feel like it's like the key to like frizz free definition or something, I don't know. Um, you guys, let me know if you've tried this out ever, if you've even heard about it. Um, it's nothing new. It's just something that I, um, I think I heard about it originally from Mono's hair. And then it kind of came back up again when I was looking at things about wash and goes and stuff. You know, I'm always trying to see if I can actually do this style and make it work for me, which in the past is something I hadn't been able to do. But anyway, enough jibber jabber. This is completely applied to all of my hair. This was like the easiest application process ever, I felt. A little definitely goes a long way. There's no need for this to slosh and sl slather all over your hair and look white and snowy and crazy. You can see it's all applied to my hair and my hair is not white. But we're gonna talk about proper product application in another video. For the purposes of this video, we're just testing this out, so I'm going to let you know my thoughts. Um, let me give you 360 so you can actually see how it looks applied everywhere. And I'm going to go sit under the hooded dryer. That's been my new thing lately. I kind of favor my results more once I sit under the dryer versus air drying because I just I catch the shrinkage. like. <laughs> really bad so I'm gonna see if that helps with my shrinkage um it's already shrinking up you know but that's a big spectacle we're gonna see what we get 
from this. So far, so good. I have never seen my hair look this defined after applying a product. So I'm excited about that. I'll be back once I am. I probably won't be all the way dry, but for the majority part, um, once the majority of my hair is dry, I'll be back. All right. Oh, and I only used about that much, which wasn't much at all. Still at the top of the container, so a little definitely goes a long way with this product. Okay, you guys, I am back, and my hair is dry. Um, it's probably about 75% dry. Dare I say 85% dry. That overhead dryer got, if you put it on high, <laughs> it goes like it jumps into action so I have definitely have a gel cast which I was expecting based on you know what I've seen about this product um so I'm gonna take a little bit of the argan oil that I use to kind of eliminate some of the crunchiness and see if I can fluff it out because it's just very very clumped together right now Um, and I'll just, I'll show you what I mean. I don't know if you can actually see how clumped it is, but it's very clumped together. So, take some of this on my hands and just kind of pull it apart. Well, wow. it definitely has a lot of hold, definitely gives your hair a lot of shine. Um... Like, I feel like these curls ain't going nowhere. They are in there, like swimwear. Well, no flaking, you guys. No white, crunchy stuff in my hair. And my hair definitely has movement. It still definitely has its volume and body. This is pretty awesome. If I thought I could never do a wash and go before, I definitely can now. It takes patience, care, and the right products. So I'm not speechless, but I'm definitely wowed and amazed. Um, I mean, I wasn't expecting anything less. I told you guys I was already in love with the leave-in condi leave conditioner from their the same line and um, it works pairs very well with the coiling custard which I wouldn't expect anything less usually when you formulate a line you formulate the products to work together and these definitely work together well so yes this is definitely a wash and go that I would write home to mom about. That is really all I have to say, you guys. Like, I'm impressed. I knew I would be impressed. I knew I would love it. So now my little organ is just gonna have all of my money. But it's cool because they give you a lot of product. It went a long way and gives me great results. I can't wait to see how long this is last. It's going to last me. I'm going to attempt to Keep track of it day by day. Don't shoot me if I don't, but I'm gonna try to. And see how long this lasts, but this definitely got a good hold and definitely well defined. So, I love it, I'm excited. I don't got super shrinkage like I usually do. Um, happy about that as well. And I gotta stop playing in my hair before I frizz it up, so. Okay. All right, so I love it. So you guys, let me know what you thought of this video. If you have tried the Maya Organics Honey Pomegranate line with the Cold Sculpting Duster and Leave-In Conditioner, let me know how you liked it. Did you enjoy using the product? Did you get good results? Um, let me know if you enjoyed this video. Let me know if there are other products from this line that I should try that you want to see. 
And until then, please remember to live out loud, own your truth, and let your light shine.